Hey everybody, I am out on my walk trying to get my probably right around 15 miles in. Still here in Tally. Um, really working hard to try to get out of here. Uh, been here for like two months now and it is crazy how mm, interesting Tally is. <laughs> uh, Tally is Tallahassee by the way. Anyway, so I'm trying to work on website stuff working on preparing to write another book. This one's going to be about five-year journey um, that first year. Really excited about it. Really excited about getting more stuff on the website. Um, currently I have uh, photos from when I lived on the streets for a year in New York. Uh, photos from um, series, different series that I've shot. And then uh, photos from uh, my uh, one month in San Francisco uh, for the Here in SF uh, project that I did uh, living on the streets there as well so going to start working soon on getting the photos from the first year of the journey traveling around uh, during that first year as I mentioned yesterday uh, during that first year I visited I, maybe actually the first year in a couple months I visited um, 50 different cities and stayed with over 70 different hosts in those cities. Basically a host was a stranger, somebody that I'd never met before. Yesterday I talked about how I kind of tried to end the journey but really couldn't end it, but really wanted to so that I could spend some time with Stafford um, and how I fell in love with Stafford along the way. And I didn't expect to fall in love, of course. Uh, I don't think anybody that really falls in love does expect it wasn't something I was really looking for. I mean, I was traveling around the country, traveling around, open to traveling around the world, and definitely did not expect uh, to meet anybody and fall in love. It was like the last thing on my mind. Actually, probably one of the last things I ever wanted. I didn't really want it. Um, but it happened. And so ever since it happened in October in Orlando, um, I have been struggling and trying to figure out how to make a relationship work while I travel and be long distance and I am here to tell you it's near impossible and yeah <laughs> and um, it's been a struggle sorry Stafford's texting me on the phone that I'm using and so I'm reading text from him he texts me to say uh, baby I'm going to marry the fuck out of you thanks Stafford I love you <laughs> anyway so yeah um, about that I'm working really super hard to try to uh, get my photography to where it makes money of some sort. Um, something else I've learned is that if you want to survive and survive comfortably, you need to. Sorry, chew my ear. Um, you need to be able to make some money somehow. So um, I'm going to start trying to schedule photo shoots and hopefully make money while still offering uh, photos for free for people that can't afford to do photos. Um, I feel like that's something special and I probably won't ever back away from that. Um, it gives me something to do with my time. It's more, um, more practice for me to shoot photos and it gives something for free and I, I really love that. But if somebody can pay me for a photo shoot, I will definitely accept, um, especially in the position I am in trying to get to be with Stafford. Um, and so we can kind of begin our lives together. But I don't want to show up and be a burden and not be making money myself. But, and I also want to be able to do photography and work in photography and videography and uh, write. So, hopefully something good comes of that. Uh, we will see. Yeah, so, um, really working hard to try to get out of Tally. I've been staying here with some uh, good friends, Dennis and Sergio, and I'm very thankful that they have uh, given me a place to stay for a little while while I try to get kind of a solid foundation. I've been working on the website. The website is jeremy.com, J-E-R-A-H-M-E.com, and uh, working on, it's basically an art project in itself because I'm setting it up to where people can come there and see all of my work um, and buy prints and books and um, help kind of support me with the work that I do. So that's that. Hopefully somewhere, somehow, I get some photo shoots scheduled, make some money, start making some money, and just move forward with it. 
and I'm going to share the experience as I go right here on my YouTube. <laughs> um, I'm glad to be making YouTube videos. It kind of is like a good way for me to kind of voice what's going on in my head, share different experiences, um, share different plans and what I'm doing and just share myself and hopefully somebody gets something out of it. I don't know. Anyway, love you guys. Thank you for checking out the video. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't yet. Sorry it's bouncing and I'm walking, but this is that and that is this and yeah. <laughs> love you guys. Bye.